A self-proclaimed super mayor in Illinois is facing more calls to resign. Here's Taylor Tinsley with more. The mayor of Dalton, Illinois, is facing heavy backlash and calls for her resignation. Dalton residents are fed up with Tiffany Henyard. This is a disgrace that you have done to this village. This self-proclaimed super mayor has come under fire for misusing public funds and manipulating residents for her own profit. During a recent monthly hearing, speakers demanded transparency, along with Henyard's resignation, as well as most of the board of trustees. Mayor, you need to step down because you have disgraced this village. You really have. Everybody up there need to go. You are a disgrace. You didn't put black folks all the way back. And these officers, I'm ashamed of y'all because y'all are not honoring y'all badge the correct way because y'all doing all the stuff that the men want y'all to do. And it's not right. That's not how police officers are supposed to act. You're supposed to protect us. I'm afraid of you all. Trustees are also growing tired of Henyard, saying she has left bills unpaid and withheld business permits while the community is millions of dollars in debt. Henyard has made national headlines in recent months after spending taxpayer dollars on a luxury trip to Vegas. She has also filmed music videos, hired DJs for town meetings, taken cops off the streets for her own security detail, and placed billboards with her face all over the Chicago suburb, all on the taxpayer's dime. Last month, Henyard vetoed an FBI investigation into her spending. The board recently announced they plan to hire former Chicago Mayor Lori Lightfoot to investigate Henyard's spending as additional legislative counsel. Meanwhile, outside of the meeting, members of the community were pounding on the doors after being locked out. The doors to City Hall have been closed for over a week, only open to employees. Officials said it was a safety precaution due to threats of violence, but residents aren't buying it. We are being treated as the resident, I say we, as, as though we were in prison, in our, in our own town, in a place where we pay taxes. Henyard was first elected in 2021. She also serves as the supervisor of Thornton Township and received $285,000 for both positions last year. Legislation pushed through by Henyard would cut that salary by 90% if she isn't reelected. The mayor has denied any wrongdoing and called the meeting a political theater stunt. We didn't get through any business as it relates to a scheduled board meeting here in our village, which we're supposed to do. But yeah, everybody cry about meetings and we should have more. Why well, have more meetings when it's going to just be chaotic like this? Our job is to make sure we take care of the business and not allow the business to handle us. The board is expected to vote on the resolution to hire Lightfoot Monday. Taylor Tinsley, One America News. For all our viewers asking where One America News is heading in the future, we would like to introduce you to OAN Live. OAN Live is the best way to stay up to date on all of the hard-hitting, straight-shooting, national and international headlines. And the best part is, OAN Live is only $4.99 per month. All the credible, honest, unbiased reporting One America News offers at a fraction of the cost of cable. Just go to OANN.com to easily sign up for OAN Live and stay informed.